vlog day 414. All I need is you, baby, baby. Good morning. It's almost noon. I was up till four in the morning editing. It's a little late. Um, and today I have a handful of things I need to get done, which is no surprise. These things don't change. I was going to just stay here and get that stuff done. And I do it. I am on hold, so I need to double check that I'm actually not going to need to work. But the reason that it's all coming to like the big, oh, well, maybe I will put that off for just a little bit is that Ali rented a car and wants to drive to a town south of here, like 50 miles south of here. Uh, and has like a castle, and that sounds awesome. Who wants to go see a castle? I want to go see a castle. These are the kinds of decisions that keep cropping up when it's like, I need to get some work done, and I need to do laundry, but I want to go see a castle. Ah, this is life in France. So, people keep wondering, what does life in France look like? Let me tell you, it's always a decision between getting your work done and going and seeing a castle. But it's Sunday. I need to have some fun someday. Let's go see a castle. Oh yeah, let's double check. I don't have to stay here and, and I'd like actually work though. I need you, baby, baby. As for productivity, it seems like a reasonable trade, really. I mean, either I'd have to spend four or five, well, five hours really with travel working, or I could spend five hours going to a castle. So if I'm not gonna have to work, might as well go see. We're going to Provence, or it's not, not Provence like the region, but Provence, Provence, Provence maybe? P-R-O-V-I-N-S, if you really want to get a spoiler and look it up before we get there yourself. Ow. The turnstile just clipped my leg. Ow. Basically the only way this backfires is if Christian gets back to me and says that I do have to work. Because I had to leave right away to be able to meet them in time to flee from the loop and go see this castle. Christian hadn't given me the final yes or no yet, so I could just end up wasting an hour of my time on the Metro, which there are worse things that could happen, but could be doing laundry right now, which would be a way better way to spend my time. This is where it's supposed to be. I, Eddie and I were just here obviously making a video that I have yet to produce. Uh, and it's really funny because we noticed there was a car rental place here. Now I just gotta see if I can find that because Ali's not responding to my texts anymore. According to WhatsApp, they're not even getting all the way through to her. So, let's see if we can find her. Well, I found a Hertz. No Ali though, so. I think this is my chance to maybe grab some food. You, baby, baby. It's funny how no matter where you go in the world, McDonald's sounds pretty much exactly the same. And so while we're standing here, the thought that I have for this, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these and just on random days, or maybe over the course of a week, fill it up. There are 15 exposures on this, so I'm gonna take 15 photos, just random, and then I figure, like I can send them to you guys. If somebody out there wants one of these, my plan would be basically to take photos. Like today I'll take one of the Louvre, we'll start in the Louvre and we'll end up at some castle, and then you can have this. I haven't come up with any ideas of how to distribute them or what to do, and obviously shipping them from France is not necessarily within my budget every week, but we'll figure something out. If you're interested, let me know in the comments. If this is a silly idea, then I'll just fill them up with photos and then we'll figure something else to do. Selfie cam, sorry about that. But apparently there may not be a car. Yeah. Was that a question? That was a question oh. actually. Oh. What happened? So I think she, I think she, I mean, she went to the AA and it's now one. Uh, a car? She can get it. You're more expensive. That's a good idea. Okay, before we take our Louvre potty break, we just came here to check it out and get McDonald's basically because they and gave take Gustav to the Louvre. and take Gustav to the Louvre. Look at that, They're Gustav in the Louvre. In the Louvre. <laughs> oh, you gotta pick him up. <laughs> oh, you Gustav. Who are you? Like, oh, you Gustav. <laughs> Anyways, they gave our uh, reservation away because we're a few hours late. We're gonna go down the street. Oh yeah. No, 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 you should get one. I want a photo of just him looking at the bottom. 
Also, this disposable camera might have a photo of Phil and Gustav in the Louvre on it. Okay, attempt number one to leave the city. Abject failure. Attempt number two, underway, I think. No idea where we're going at this point. Oh, I know where we are, though. This thing does not fit. Let's go up. Renting a car from this uh, bright orange. It looks. It feels like we should be renting like construction equipment. We'll see what we end up getting out of it. Hopefully, we just get a pack of motorcycles. So we were gonna leave at noon, or by 12:30. It is now 1:40. See if we get out of here. It's gonna be a crunch tonight to get everything done, though. Supposedly the car is being prepared now, so we, uh, we should be out of here soon. It's like 2:15, I think. Nothing. I was going back to Gustav being Gustav. Alright, good stuff, you gotta make, gotta make room, buddy. Steph and I are sitting out here waiting for work wife, and then Olivia's over there. Why don't you sit here and take food? She just wanted to get a coffee and use the bathroom. Anyways, we're gonna go into the castle here in a minute. We'll see if the uh, visit is excuse new. That's how Phil deals with uh, small animals, right? All I need is you, baby, baby. We, uh, we had to separate because, what? Okay, uh, we had to separate groups there a little bit because Gustav is not allowed in the castle, which is a wise decision on the French government's part. So instead, uh, the girls went in first and we will go in second. I wanted to say thank you so much. I'm feeling a lot better today. I wanted to actually thank Chris, Matt, and Francois in particular for you guys' gifts. I really, really appreciate it. And everyone else who's reached out and who, I've, they're just a really overwhelming response. Gustav has smelled a cat, so he's really excited about that. This could not end well. Maybe stay back here, Gustav. I don't think they're gonna make the best of friends. Yeah, I just wanted to take a moment to say thank you, specifically to those three, but also to everybody who's reached out. So everybody's jumped on Patreon this last month. It grew a lot. I'm just feeling a lot better today. It's nice to get out of the city for a minute. I just hang out with some friends and see a new castle. And I do need to get some work done tonight, but I feel like I'll be even, I'll be really productive actually this evening, having just kind of gotten out of town. So, ah, uh, totally random. I didn't know I was gonna be doing this today. Allie just texted me out of the blue and was like, we're leaving from the Louvre in 30 minutes. And I was like, ah, and obviously it took us another two and a half hours, but still, it's really, really nice to be out here. And thank you guys for your support in general. Like I really, I really appreciate it. I gotta formulate my thoughts on it a little bit better, but I just wanted to let you know that uh, it meant a lot to me and I will be eating some tasty food. I don't know what Gustav's doing. Look at that, gorgeous. Those fruit flies. Like it's, whoa! Look at this. Ow! It's like entering Rivendell. Oh my God! We know you. Hello. I thought he was just flirting with some random girl there for a second. 
All I need yeah, is to, technically we're not allowed to film inside. So we'll come back outside in just a second. You, baby, baby. This is incredible. This is amazing. This is, this, I, we think this is an aqueduct, I'm sure it is, but there's like, there's a forest growing on top of it. All the way down there, you can see trees growing on top of it here, but all the way down, where we can't see right now, it's, it's actually thicker, and on top there's just like, it's all forest. This is amazing, you should come out and see this. This is highly recommended if you have time to come outside of Paris. Just don't bring, just don't bring Phil with you, it'll be miserable. Look at that. Well, we're back outside. The girls are nowhere to be found, but they're around the corner we just found out, so we a nice little walk to find them. This is about to die. Wonderful visit to the castle. This thing is incredible, and the, the paintings, you're not allowed to photograph or film inside, which is a travesty because the paintings in this building are by far, I think, superior to the ones that you'd find in Versailles, especially of the royal family. You see, it's, they are beautiful paintings here. Phil, would you give it a thumbs up, or would you... Two. Two thumbs up. Good sign right there. So anyways, we're just gonna stand out here in the rain until we get a ride out of here and then hopefully find some food along the way. Could we have done this somewhere potentially more soon? What, talking to the camera? Yeah, for sure. But this is real life. But then we've we've been um, stranded here. We've been stranded. There's, it would be more scenic to have talked about it inside, really, but we yeah. were trying to get out here on time so that we would yeah, make them so wait. we would get picked up. We didn't want them to wait for we us. We don't know, there's no train station in this town. I don't know, actually. We are a long ways out of town, either way. I don't know what the hell. I, I think you should um, add like a postscript after this to find out what the hell happened. We'll let you know. My phone's about to die, so uh, I will... No, it's on, it's on. I'll, I'll let you know how this, I will let you know how this turned out after I can charge it, but. We're, we're at the hunger stage, definitely need food. We made it, we made it back into town. No worries, the only downside was that um, I got dropped off a long ways away from home, which is my own fault, because I misjudged what street we were turning onto, and she's like, I'll just get out here. Anyways, overall, I had a great time. The girls wandered off to try and break the car. Uh, and that was about it. But they specifically requested that I not include that part in the story. Like, wh how, what happened? So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this tour of the castle. Please do subscribe, like this video, and uh, you know, leave comments. Hopefully uh, you'll come back again for more wonderful content tomorrow. And if you haven't checked out Patreon, I am gonna be uploading a monument link. I think a monument poll will go up today. I'm gonna try and do that right now. So, see you, see you on Patreon.